guys welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video big huge barrel these are some of the words that we use to describe our belly especially when we are overweight or our belly is just really big like much larger than it's supposed to be and that is accumulated belly fat belly fat tend to accumulate around the stomach region which is not really healthy at all all. Now, when we tend to get all these excessive belly fat, some people tend to lose their self esteem, while some people tend to run into problems. Medical sedation tend to happen because the belly fat tend to cover some vital organs of the body. Therefore, we need to get rid of the excessive belly fat, whether we're trying to get rid of it for a health reason or we're trying to get rid of it so we could look really nice in our clothes. So, if you find that your stomach area is getting a little too big, if you find you're having way too much belly fat, guess what? You need to do something about it. You can get rid of the belly fat by starting to eat a healthy diet. You can start to exercise, do some crunches, drink a lot of water, and along with that, you can use this wonderful oil that I'm going to share with you today. This is a belly fat oil. You're going to use it to massage on the skin, and I'm going to show you some wonderful technique in which you could apply the oil on your skin for best results. So if you're looking to get rid of all that excessive glycerol fat in the stomach, region and also on the back and the hip and the thigh this video is for you so continue watching our first ingredient is cinnamon powder now let's take a look at the cinnamon powder up close I'm using cinnamon powder because cinnamon help with circulation of the blood now when you're trying to get rid of belly fat you definitely need that blood flow now applying cinnamon powder mixed with other ingredients is going to create an evil blood flow and even circulation which is going to help to eliminate those belly fat in no time our next ingredient is peppermint oil and peppermint oil has a lot of wonderful benefits to the body. Peppermint oil will help to decrease bloating, stomach ache, and many other things. However, when mixed with the other ingredient, peppermint is also going to help with circulation and it's going to help to eliminate belly fat when massaged on the skin. Our next ingredient is a vapor rub. And I'm using this vapor rub because of the camphor in it. The camphor in vapor rub will help to decrease a belly fat when used on a regular. We're using this camphor as a massager. It's going to help to loosen up those fat and with continuous use, eliminate the belly fat. Our next ingredient is almond oil and this I'm using as a carrier oil. Almond oil, however, is a great carrier oil to use to eliminate belly fat. Now, almond oil has other benefits such as lightening and brightening the skin. Almond oil also have to moisturize the skin. It penetrates deep in the skin, leaving the skin just soft, supple and just moisturize. You're also going to need a bottle for storing your belly fat oil. The first thing we're going to use is our vapor rub. And I'm using a half of a teaspoon of vapor rub. So we're just going to dig in. And here we have the half of a teaspoon of vapor rub. We're going to put this in our container. Make sure to get everything out. Moving on to our peppermint. We're using a quarter teaspoon of peppermint oil. A quarter teaspoon. And we're pouring that along with the vapor rub. And we're just gonna blend the two together first to begin with. So just blend your vapor rub and your peppermint. Just blend it in. And that's good. Next, we're moving on to our carrier oil, which is our sweet almond oil. And we're going to be using about three tablespoons of sweet almond oil. And that's good. Three tablespoons. 
we're going to mix this again, making sure that our vapor rub melt in our sweet almond oil. So just blend. And this smells really, really great. Now once the vapor up has completely melt, you will notice it's a little thick. Take a look, a little thick, and that's good. And next we're gonna add our cinnamon powder. And we're using one teaspoon of the cinnamon powder. If you have cinnamon oil, then you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna use a half a teaspoon of cinnamon oil. We're putting this in. And now we're gonna just blend the powder in. And yes, it's going to look a little dark, but that's okay. So just blend it in. Now guys, if you are looking for a great smell, you can choose to add essential oil to this. However, be very specific with your essential oil. You can add some frankincense oil. You can add some neroli oil. You can even choose to add some eucalyptus oil to this to keep kids up at night. And my favorite to add is the sweet orange oil. It's beneficial to the skin and it also have a wonderful fragrance. So I'm just gonna add about three drops of the orange essential oil. Optional, guys. If you do not have this, this is optional, okay? This is mostly for fragrance, all right? So then we're just gonna blend this. You know, most people like to use these on their skin just before bed. So you want to have a really nice pleasant smell and now this is ready for bottling not ready to use but for bottling so you're going to pour this in a jar of your choice mine is very tiny i don't know i'm going to get it in but i'm going to try oops now here is your belly fat burning oil, however, it is not yet ready. What you need to do is to put this aside for about three to four days, maybe up to a week, for the cinnamon to infuse in the oils. And this way, it's gonna give you a better result. So after infusion, then the oil is ready to use to burn that belly fat. So I'm gonna go on the other side and I'm gonna show you a few techniques in massaging this oil on the skin for best result. Now moving on to the belly massages. Now the first exercise you're going to be doing is some breathing. So you're going to take your hands and you're going to overlap your hands and your stomach like this. Then place them on your stomach on the top of your navel. Then you're going to inhale and push your hands down on the stomach and exhale. Now you're going to do this about 10 times. So press, inhale and exhale. 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 next exercise you're going to place both hands on either side of your belly with your palm facing each other like I'm showing here then you're going to push your hand towards each other while squeezing your stomach between them you're going to do this exercise at least 10 times so open squeeze release 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 the next massage is to place your right hand under the left rib and perform a small circular massage. Now you're going to use their right hand and massage the left area and next you're going to take your left hand and massage the right area in circular motion. You want to do this about 10 times. Make sure to use your oil. Next, you're going to oil your hands again and this time you're going to shake your stomach. Press the oil on the skin and just shake, 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 almost like a jelly belly. Grab your stomach and just shake it, shake it, shake it. And then you're gonna massage your hands 
all over your stomach like I'm showing here. Keep doing this for about three minutes and then you are done so there you have it thank you all for watching if you like the video just give it a thumbs up share the video leave your comments those are also welcome and if this was your first time watching look below you're gonna see the word subscribe click on it and you will be subscribed also if you look below the video you're gonna see a drop down arrow that is the description box in the description box you will find a link to my Amazon storefront you will find a link to my merchandise you will also get the link to my Facebook my Twitter my Instagram my snapchat and you name it so just browse around in the description box thank you all for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye bye